Hi everyone, it's Andrew Whitehouse here, and this week we're talking about pregnancy, and in particular the idea that if a mum has the flu during pregnancy, that increases the chances that a baby may develop autism. Now, this idea has actually been around for quite a few years, and it's based on the hypothesis that little bits of protein called antibodies that the body produces in response to the flu might actually pass from the mother into the developing fetus, alter neurodevelopment, and ultimately lead a child to develop autism. While this makes really good biological sense, it actually hasn't been tested in a large population sample. Now, the study we've linked to this week examined 200,000 mother-child pairs in California. Now, about 1% of these 200,000 pregnancies, uh, so 1% of women, had the flu during pregnancy. The main finding that there was no difference in the proportion of kids who ultimately develop autism between those mums who uh, had the flu during pregnancy and those mums who didn't have the flu during pregnancy. So the main finding here is that in this large population sample, the large sample size is important because it means that we have some accuracy in, uh, in the findings, there is no link between whether a mum experiences the flu during pregnancy and the chances of the child developing autism.